virou uma verdadeira tendência na hotelaria internacional. Hotéis como o Royal Mansão em Paris chegam a ter concierges especializados no assunto só para atender seus hóspedes. Também em Paris, o No Address, assim como o Gramercy Park em Nova York, viraram verdadeiras galerias de arte. Veja mais agora. Quando it came to uh, decide on our concierge team, you know, we decided to have con art concierge specialized in art. Uh, the ladies we have um, uh, appointed were um, employ employees and managing galleries in Paris, so they know everything about the history of art, what's going on in Paris, what's going on in the world, the exhibitions, uh, the auctions, and they and you know they are communicating, of course, uh, all of this information to our clients, but offering very special, exclusive access, you know, to not only the Louvre Museum but also to private collections, you know, that might be sometimes very difficult to get. The owner and uh, his uh, partner in the gallery wanted, like, uh, to bring art, art as a like a nearly a gener generosity factor like uh, to to instead of uh, being uh, only in galleries we will uh, provide them and uh, bring them at the eye of uh, our guests so it was mostly like uh, a generous act we also have a really marvelous art collection it was uh, given to us by our uh, owner av rosen he is one of the uh, world's largest collectors of 20th century art So we have between 80 and 100 pieces of original art throughout the hotel, and that changes about every three months. And uh, we have a very unique collection of books coming f mostly featuring, you know, art and uh, uh, architecture, you know, and um, anything that is related to us. We were thinking that if you, if you want to be close to uh, our guest uh, proper home, uh, bringing them with uh, art pieces, will help us actually to create really the home feeling uh, at a very close point. So every season you'll find a new art collection. So the hotel is sort of, a, it's like a museum as well. And people come to the hotel just to see the art.